Greetings programs. This is Wretch and welcome back to Saturday Morning RPG. In the last episode, Commander Hood had stolen Christmas and Marty uh, went and ran and did some various uh, Christmas time quests for the people of Shadow Valley. And we actually stole a Hood Trooper jet and am now heading to what I guess is the North Pole or wherever Commander Hood's lair is to try and uh, save Santa Claus. So you can't get more straightforward than that. So let's head this way. What does this say? Wow. Fair enough. Let's get on ye old hoverboard. What the? I'm fighting presents? What the crap? Okay. Um, charge? What is the present going to do? Oh, horrible things. I see. Well, let's uh, stop that one with the low count. Oh. Okay, that healed me. Rank B, $20. That's very confusing. Okay, there's a hood trooper. Let's see. I'm really glad the hoverboards work on frozen water. Let's sneak attack this Yeti. Or this ice creature. Very similar to the ones that Marty fought in the first episode. Okay, we got the sneak attack bonus. Let's see if that can just... If that can take care of it just right off the bat. Oh! We can send the snowballs back to him. Oh, I missed it. I'm out of practice. 4.7 should work, though. Ow. Let's try that again, with a little less fail this time. There we go. Much better. Let's throw some pencils and see if that'll take care of this guy. Looks like it. Another rank of B. Dun dun. Back on the hoverboard. Of course, I knew it was you. I felt your presence. I'm sorry. No, no, I'm not sorry at all. <laughs> Let's keep on scratching. Okay. I do have to say about this game, from what I oh hello, from what I've realized that if this combat system, if kind of like the interface was a little bit better, if you had multiple people in your party and stuff like that, this game would be like one of the best of all time. Okay, you're out of there. Let's throw the par There we go. And I'm not sure if this present's gonna hurt me. So we'll keep on throwing pencils until it goes away. One more ought to do it. There we go. And... Ooh! Rick Astley's. What do we get? A hamburger. Which I believe... Yeah. Do we have something new? Oh, the hamburger was new. Strength one, defense one. Okay, that's pretty cut and dry. Let's keep going. There's another Yeti. He's just chilling there. So we'll fight him head on. Oh, that's a Yeti and a heel trooper. So let's charge up. Before he buffs him. And knock him completely out of the fight. There we go. That's better. Get out of here. Much better. Now, let's... I'm going to just do the quick charge. That seems to be more than enough for us. Especially if we they keep doing that. That won't be a problem. And I'll throw all the pencils. Oh, 
Rank of A. That's better. That's what I like to see. And back on the board. Exploration bonus. And I'm not sure what this does. It's green. Hmm. Wait a sec. Let me get off the hoverboard here. Yeah, doesn't let me do anything. Probably another switch is somewhere here in the ice that we have to find. Yeah, there it is. There was that sign that said absolute gibberish. Let's take out this guy. This guy looks new and exciting. Blue Hood Troopers. Now, if Star Wars has taught us anything, the coolest looking troopers are the ones that are made specifically for ice combat. Snow Troopers, for example, were awesome looking, as were the uh, Cobra Snow Vipers, or whatever they were called. And goodbye, sir. And another quick charge. See, that's a lot better than just... Much easier on my thumbs, at least. Especially since we have this... The baseball bat. And a rank of S. Okay, maybe this is going to... This is just a big maze, isn't it? Well, let's just keep on fighting. Let's get all the XP that we can. More presents. Marshmallows and chocolate. Ooh, paralyzed, eh? I don't know what paralyzed does. Oh, I can't. Okay, cool. It can knock you completely out of the fight, though, if you aren't careful. And I'm still... Okay, there we go. There goes the debuff. Throw all the pencils. And we got one more. And can we punch it? Okay, that's not going to do what we needed to do. You're about to blow up or do whatever it is you do. Oh, that was fine. Rank of B. Marty's pretty powerful at this stage. That Trapper Keeper has served him quite well. Okay, that's where we would go if we had gone... Okay, I see. Another exploration bonus. So, let's head left. It's the rule of the RPG. If, some, if the game's telling you to go one way, you are almost required by law and honor to go the opposite direction. Interactive. Get your snowballs back in your face. And you go away. I'm not sure what the presents are going to do. So let's get rid of the blue one since it has the biggest countdown. Actually, considering how much damage that just took, which was minimal, we'll charge up and actually try and get it out of here. Return to sender! And... I guess we can throw some more pencils. Good lord, a grandmother must have wrapped this. And I think a good punch should take care of it. Oh! It's confetti. A rank of C. Well, that will not do. More exploration. Where is this taking us? Oh, a cave. Are we going to fight a defeat Marv and Harry? Okay. Who are Marv and Harry? I guess that's supposed to be, I guess, Russian? Think of Rick Astley's. What is that? Let's check the stickers. Gym bag. Health minus 5, but magic plus 10. Ew. Yeah, I don't think so, bud. And what are you? Added a decoder ring to the inventory. 
So let's see what that does. Wow. Five power, five speed, five accuracy. Decodes unreadable text. Oh, okay. Let's have it replace the breakfast cereal. And be sure to drink your... <laughs> um, elliptical teen. Awesome, a Christmas story reference. Be sure to drink your oval teen. So Marv and Harry, huh? Oh, these are the, uh, these were the wet bandits. I was sent here to claim a bounty on your heads. From what I hear, you've been leaving people's sinks running to flood their houses. What's wrong with you? Why did you do that? I told you not to do it. It's our calling card. All the great ones have a calling card. Your calling card got us caught. He's only a kid, Harry. We could take him. That was almost line for line. Oh, it's a boss fight, too. So scratch like you've never scratched before there, Marty. These guys can take a uh, beating if they're anything like uh, the guys from Home Alone. So a full charge. Oh, he's a uh, bad bot. We're going to charge all the way up to 9.9. And he hits pretty hard. Now, this is something, if you guys are based off the Home Alone guys, you should be familiar with, and that's a baseball bat. Let's see. Goodbye, sir. That baseball bat is disgusting when charged up. Let's do that again. At least as much as we can charge. And... Oh, I missed. Whoops. Can we still throw pencils in his face? Our good fall back, the pencils. The truest weapon of the schoolyard. Or one of them, at least. There we go. And non-interactive charge. Now, let's try this again with a little less fail. There we go. Rank of C, but that's okay. I'll take it. I thought we could take him. He's a kid. Kids are stupid. I know I was. You still are, Marv. So we took him out. Now we can report back to Bobby Jet. Do we want to go ahead and do that now? What other quest did we have? Yeah, let's see here. Tree? We need to find a Christmas tree. Okay, let's see if we can find the tree first. Now that we took care of the wet bandits for Bobby. Let's make the active quest. Still can't see anything. Nothing news popped up, I mean. Can we take the jet back to town? like to go ahead and see what we can get from... Okay, we can take the jet back. So we'll... take Let the poser bounty hunter know that we have taken care of those bandits. And then head back and finish our business. Where did he... He was over here, wasn't he? Yeah, there he is. No way! You took those guys out! I mean, like I said, I could have totally taken them out myself. I am the greatest bounty hunter of all time, if you don't recall. Anyways, thanks for the help. As if I needed it. Well, $50. For the record, Santa doesn't get Bobby Jet presents. Bobby Jet Jet gets Santa presents. That's just how important I am. If anything, Commander Hood just stole Santa's presents. What a jerk. Yeah, jerk is the appropriate word. Unfortunately, I unfortunately Bobby did not get the uh, same treatment as Django. That was such a cop out too. I'll probably go off that on in uh, depth during my Star Wars Galaxy series, but that's that's for that series, not this one. Let's take the jet back here to the frozen uh, glacier, and we went that way. We found the cave. Okay, more hood 
Oh, there looks seem to be a computer over there. Okay, a trooper, a yeti, and a present. I don't know which one to... Yeah, definitely the one who can paralyze. That just answered that question. I actually want to use the decoder ring now. Did you break... Okay, good. You broke the paralysis. I want to save it for Commander Hood, though. Yeah, let's keep it a surprise for now. There's the paralyses. And let's see if we can get you out of here. And the present's about to blow up and go boom. There you go. Okay, the red ones blow up. That's good to know. Rank of S. Everyone that I've had that's red is blown up. Oh, it's another one of the... Oh, okay. I see. Tis a puzzle. And everything up close to it seems to move. So if that's true... Maybe... Hmm. Let's go ahead and... Oh, I can't go. Dang it. Okay, first things first. There we go. Let's keep turning. And get you... Moved. Alright, that might be good for what we're needing. Okay, there was nothing south. I thought that may have led to another area. I want to head over here this way first. So let's move you over here. And that did nothing. <laughs> and we got to move you back. Well, we're getting there kind of. Oh, this... Let's move you right there. Try you one more time. There we go. That'll work. Puzzles are not my strong suit. Okay, more yetis, more hood troopers. And a blue present. I forgot what the blue one does. Is that, was that the one that does the confetti? I, I need to pay attention to that. Five. Well, we definitely need to take it out if it has a five count. That's not going to be good. So, let's go ahead and deal with that. Lay away! Speaking of, like, 80s nostalgia and... 80s and 90s nostalgia. You know what I miss? For one of the things I miss most during the Christmas season being a kid? The Sears catalog. Do you guys remember that? Because that used to be like the place to get toys. Or at least find new toys that you had never seen before. I was like, oh man. I wish I had one of the old Sears calendars still. Or calendars, Sears catalogs. They were just awesome. Because you got to see all, like, the 80s toys and 90s toys as the years went on. And then Sears stopped selling that kind of stuff. Okay, here's the thing of Rick Astley's. With the banana, which I believe that we have. Okay, we pressed that button. So let's head back to that other area that we saw that had that fence up. And I think it's this way. Oh, what does it say? Fighting the Frizzies at 11 in Shadow Valley. And you... Okay, you are open. Which is... Most welcome. What we got? Sunflower, which I know we have... Oh, we have another cave. Is this where we fight the Wampa? Oh. At least we're not hanging from the ceiling. Oh, there's three of them. Let's scratch all of them. 
These guys are pretty easy, though. As long as you can time those snowballs in their normal shots, you don't have that much of an issue. They're very nasty support, though. These guys with hood troopers would be quite annoying. That's one down. Wait a minute. Let's, uh... Let's charge up and use Optimus. We haven't used Optimus. We might as well. He's just sitting there in our inventory all alone. There we go. Good old Willem scream. Oh, and at double S. Cool. Our current strength is six and our current defense is seven. Let's go ahead and upgrade our strength. Exploration bonus. You'll shoot your eye out. Oh, it's the BB gun. Yes. And what are... Oh, we got a rare sticker. Okay, we have got to see what these things do. First things first, let's look at the sticker. Rarity of 3, scratch difficulty of 5. Experience plus 20. Hells, bells, yes. All day, every day. Let's replace the summer rain. And let's look at our BB, at our Red Rider BB gun. That's ominous music. Power, four and a half. Speed, two and a half. Accuracy of one. You'll shoot your eye out. I'll be the judge of that. Well, let's go ahead and replace uh, Sun Howl. And I bet we probably will shoot our eye out. Is there anything else in here that, uh, oh, I saw something glow. Oh, okay, that's just an effect from the... Just an effect from the, uh, snow. So that was everything over there, so now we have to set that bridge where it needs to be. And I'm kind of sad because, as far as I know, after I finish this episode, uh, Saturday Morning RPG will be on hiatus for a while on the channel because they are currently working on episode 5. It is not done yet. So we're kind of, uh, stuck. And let's go this way. Ah! It's not what I'm needing. There we go. And... Hell's bells. Come on, man. Not good with the puzzles. Not good with them at all. I'll eventually pass it just through attrition. And that's one. And... No, that's not what I was looking for. Maybe... That one. Eh, this is a tragedy. One more time. Okay, that's where we were. So... Twist this one around, maybe? You guys are probably screaming at the screen at me right now, I imagine. And I can't say I blame you. So... Hmm... Let's go with that one, maybe? have to have them stay on this course. And turn and spit. Oh, okay. I think we may have it. No, we don't have it. Dang. There's one way we can do this. And not well. <laughs> I'll tell you what, guys. I'll go ahead and pause the recording real quick, and I'll be back as soon as I figure out how exactly to do this. And I'm back about five seconds later. 
And it was staring at me right in the face. And me like a big derp, I just sat there slack-jawed. So, defeat Commander Hood. We didn't find the uh, tree for Charles Cheezer. But I guess that's okay. Life goes on. Let's... Well, I don't know. If Commander Hood's right there, we may be coming near the end of the episode. So... Let's go tree hunting, I guess. If the tree... Where would it be, then? Probably at the park, I would imagine, because I'm not seeing anything that I can cut down in this area since it's all tundra. You know what? To heck with the tree. We're just going to go ahead and have a reckoning with Commander Hood. This will be a long episode today. Besides, as far as this game's concerned, it's the holidays, right? So, onward! Oh, we get to try out the BB gun. Let's get our extra XP. And we got all the stickers. We will... We're gonna charge first. I think we're gonna try Optimus on these guys. Provided I don't get paralyzed the entire way. Let's charge again. For a 9-9. And... Optimus! You will be on your way here soon. Choo choo. Oh. Oh, it paralyzed me so I couldn't use it. Wow. Let's try the Dakota ring. And the. Okay, now I know why that's a nasty attack. Let's try the BB gun. So these are definitely some of Hood's, like, nastiest troopers. Let's just throw pencils. Eh. Wow, for 128. Okay. That was a very powerful pencil. Charge again. Oh. That was weird. It bugged out a little bit. I'm not paralyzed, so that's a good. Get you out of here. Because you guys completely ruined my fun. And now you're going to get a bunch of pencils in the face. Hopefully. Am I still paralyzed? Oh. Using all of my gear. And just a uncharged one should deal. There we go. That was horrible. But I still got a rank of A out of it. Imagine that. There's Commander Hood. Let's do this. Marty, my greatest adversary. Finally, we meet in person. Skip the formalities, Commander. I'm here for the gifts. Make this easy and hand over the gifts now. <laughs> you think you can defeat me? Me? The great Commander Hood? Try your best. Ooh. Well, there he is. It's a uh, repeat of our first fight in this game. Or almost our first fight. Our first boss fight. Oh no, it wasn't our first boss fight. That was uh, Madeline. Ow. Let's charge up again. Let's go all out against the big guy. Oh, he's got armor. Time for a Red Rider BB gun. Ow! You shot your eye out. <laughs> oh, I love it. Can that... That's... Okay, that's exactly what it says it does. Dakota ring? Wait. A crummy commercial? Paid advertisements in your paid games? Oh, wow. It's spam. Those are awesome joke yet, or joke, uh... Ooh, that knocked his armor right off. Mustache Rancher, now available. Vilville. 
That is outstanding. Ooh, that took a lot out of him. Let's do a non-interactive. Should we keep on throwing? Oh, he's bringing me presents. Let's keep... Let's throw pencils. All the pencils must be thrown. There we go. Stop this nonsense! You win this time, Marty. I could defeat you if I wanted to, but I don't want to. You can have your measly presents back. I'll have my men load them on your stolen vehicle. Oh, he just gave up! Achievement unlocked. Lundgren. Win 100 battles. Get back to Shadow Valley. That was it? We fought him right outside the, uh... Oh, are we stuck? Okay. Right outside the gates of his fortress. Wow. Well, let's go ahead and head back, because I think that might be the end of it. But where's Santa? If he's, Unless he just stole all... Oh, okay, we gotta fight our way back. I'll tell you what, guys, and we've got some nasty customers. We'll do this fight, and then we'll go ahead and call it an episode. We'll charge up. Excellent. As long as you're not, uh... As long as you're not doing that debuff, I'm happy. Or paralyzing me. I love those little joke gifts. Those are awesome. Come on. There we go. Goodbye, sir. And now you guys are going to be relatively easy. As soon as my paralyzation goes away. There we go. And... <laughs> Toasty! That takes a lot of life from him. I could have done a full charge, but that's fine. And you are going to not be a problem at all. With our last baseball card. Excellent. Rank of B. I really like that sticker. That gives us so much more XP. And do we have any more... Okay, it doesn't look like we have any more villains. Fighting the Frizzies at 11. Well, there's some Yetis there. But, and a present. I'll tell you what, guys. I'll go ahead and end the episode here, and then we'll find out what's going on. Um, if you liked the episode, go ahead and click like down below. Subscribe to the channel or leave a comment. That'd be a big help. And we'll see you next time. Later days, everyone.